There goes our venison, guys. I see I told you he's gonna bring me some venison. I always get a bucket. Check him out. Oh, that's gonna make some good stew, guys. Oh, he's big. Look at that. Oh, yeah, he's like a 10 foot. No kidding. I got my cherry wood bacon right here, right here. I'm gonna be cooking. Got my frying pan. Yeah, Cash 5150, he wants to know what this tastes like. So, uh, cook it and do a review on it. But, uh, oh shit, who the hell is this? Look who just showed up, guys. Hey it's guys, the, what's up? It's the Huntsman. If y'all don't know him, I'll put a link to his channel there. there. He, does some, he does some crazy stuff outdoors. And um, I think he might have brought us some venison, so uh, may have to skip on the apple wood, I mean on the cherry wood bacon and, and have me some venison stew. So um, we're gonna have to catch you guys later. Like I said, the Huntsman Bush Crafter series, he does some great stuff outside, it's pretty cool. He got a little cabin out there in those woods. I think he came from those woods right over there, as a matter of fact. Pretty close. But yeah, so um, y'all check out his channel and uh, we're gonna have us some venison stew. Catch you later. Okay, normally, I'll be cooking with uh, one of these three right here. But now that it's winter time, temperature in the 20s, it, it's hard to uh, get these cast iron skillets up to temperature and uh, for any length of time, especially for a long period of time with those uh, the campfire propane uh, little portable grills that I have, the little tabletop butane burner and then the propane that little propane campfire thing yeah um, this cold wind it doesn't do too well so um, we'll try something new for winter time for cooking so let me get everything out and um, get back to you in that and show you what I'm going to be testing out here now you know No, this is not what I'm cooking. This is um, breakfast. Hot logic mini. This right here, that's what I'm going to be testing out, cooking, since it's too cold to be cooking on my um, cast iron skillets. I already have everything in here cut up and ready to go. Well, I just have to take it up to the truck and plug it in a cigarette lighter, and it's a slow cooker, so we're going to see how it does. You'll get to see what's in there afterwards. I'll get to smell it while I'm driving down the road. So, yeah, we're going to test out these hot modules and see how they um, cook on the road. Yeah, it's cold out there. Okay, see you guys. All right, she's been cooking now for about five hours. Um, she smells good, so it's about time to take it in and um, see how it did. Sorry, I didn't mean to walk right in front of you. Video taping. Done. 
took about seven hours or so. She cooks at the same temp and time as the low setting on the pot pot plate. So if you're going to make some stew like this, there's beef or venison. It's going to take about seven, seven hours, eight hours. So start at the beginning of the day and when we get done, nice good healthy meal here. Come on, go Ducks.